from instructions on how to set your bridge rectifier up. We use these bridge rectifiers on all DC and ultra core three wire wind generators. This is rated at 100 amp. Your three wires come in here from your wind turbine three wire AC. Use suitable cable for the cable length needed. If you're running on short cable, you could use a 14 gauge. If you're going a little bit longer, use 12 or 10 AWG. I only use this by the meter. So if you're using longer runs, 20 foot, go down to 12 or 10 AWG. Always use a multi-stranded copper cable. On the DC output, I use a 12.2 depending on the cable length again. This is a DC battery cable. It's copper and silver coated. You don't have to have silver coated, you can just go for copper. It has got hundreds of strands in it. Every strand of wire carries AC or DC volts and amps for a longer distance than a solid cable. On the side of the bridge rectifier, they are always marked on the bottom here. So make sure you connect the positive and negative to the correct side of your battery. These two wires here go direct to the battery. Always fit a fuse here or at the battery end, it doesn't matter which end, but fit a fuse rated to the power what you need. 12 volt, 75 amp, 24 volt, 40 amp, 48 volt, 20 amp. 24 volt or 48 volt at 20 or 40 amp is rated just under a kilowatt. Usually fuses always go above than what they say, unless you get a fast blow fuse. Mount this bridge rectifier on a suitable back plate with an air gap, because bridge rectifiers get very hot and you need that heat to disperse through the back plate. Use alloy, aluminum or aluminium, which is all the same thing, or a good stainless steel. Once fitted correctly and protected with fuses, this will last you for years. Thank you.